Hello, this is How to Bob, and I made this video to show you how to install a three post thumb screw kitchen strainer. This is a stainless steel model here, and I've got a brand new sink that I'm going to install this in. It's going to go right down here. You can see my strainer. It's going to go right in here. I'm going to start out by loosening the thumb screws. And I also need to take the nut off of the bottom here and set that to the side. I'll use that when I hook up the drain. But I want to loosen up my thumb screws so that I can remove the triangular shaped plate on the bottom. Just makes it easier to start out with these thumb screws loose. Now that I've got them loose, I can spin the plate all the way off the threads and set that aside right now. And then you'll see there's a metal plate here and then followed by a rubber washer. Now I'm going to start off with plumber's putty and what I want to do is take a little bit of plumber's putty here and just roll it out into a tube. It doesn't have to be real thick but it has to be long enough to go all the way around the diameter of the drain. And then I'll take my plumber's putty and run it right around the corner of the drain. I have a little bit extra here. I can just pull that off and make sure I got a good coverage of plumber's putty. Push it in to make sure I have enough. Then I'm going to go to the top of the sink and push my drain down into the recess for the drain. I want to make sure that it's centered. Then I put my rubber washer on first. Then my metal plate goes on after the rubber washer. Then I take my triangular plate and that gets screwed on the threads on the bottom of the drain. Once I get that started it goes a little bit easier and I can just spin that around here. And I want to get that fairly tight. It doesn't have to be real, real tight, but I want to leave enough threads so I can tie my drain line into it. Now the next thing I want to do is start tightening the thumb screws on the bottom and I'm going to rotate around. I don't want to tighten all of one side at one time so just go around tighten one, tighten another, tighten the next one. And you can see there's a little slot. I'm going to use my screwdriver and this will give it a little extra torque. If I stick my slotted screwdriver into the little slot on the thumb screw just enables me to get it a little bit tighter and again, I'm going to tighten it a little bit, each one. Gives it even pressure that way. And I'll go around and check again, make sure that they're all about even. And it looks good. It looks pretty tight. Now I'm going to have to go up to the top of the sink, and you'll see this plumber's putty has come out. I just take my screwdriver and lightly go around the edge of the drain to clean it up. And that's how you install a three post thumb screw kitchen strainer. I'm How To Bob. Thanks for watching.